Hello and welcome to this training session. My name is Ashraf Ayad and uh, today we're going to be talking about how to disable the LZW compression on the TIFF file that gets exported out of Mudbox. And the reason we do that because if you take your uh, TIFF file that is default uh, out of Mudbox and you apply it to a uh, any sphere or whatever object in your uh, scene and you try to render it with Mentoray, you will get this error. As you can see in here, LZW comp file format type is not supported. And that's because of that LZW compression that we just mentioned in a, c a couple of seconds ago. So, in the workarounds that we have, you can either, if you're doing a paint, you can use a TGA, or when you're exporting a 32, you should use a EXR file. And this uh, solution we're going to be talking about is we're going to disable that LZW compression at all, uh, for once and all for all so you're not going to have to worry about that however it comes with a price because the compression saves on your hard disk size for example this is my uh, same exact file the one with no compression it's 12 megs and with the compression is 4.8 so it's almost triple the size if you just disable that compression and this is a very important thing you need to remember if you disable that you're going to be eating a lot of your hard disk so put that in mind so let's get started I just want to point out that I'm using a plist edit pro which is a free app that can be downloaded from the Mac site it just made it easier for me for me when I was doing this exercise and here's the uh, URL for it just in case if you need to find it or just google plist edit pro and you'll find it so these are the command that I'll be using and for that I'm just gonna t jump into my uh, terminal window and first I'd like to thank my buddy Rourke he's allowing me to use his uh, MacBook Pro so thanks buddy we're gonna do simple commands here which one is the the first one which is gonna make a directory which is this command and once we put a dot before the name of the directory that means it's gonna be a hidden directory therefore if you try to search for it you're not gonna see it and then I'm just gonna continue typing pretty much I added a file it's called plist it's environment variable and now I'm just gonna open it alright so this is the uh, plist editor pro that I was telling you about and all I'm gonna do now is just add a child so select my root add a child this is the new item and I'm just gonna add this environment variable that I have here which is Mudbox no compression on the TIFF LZW. So I might as well copy that to make sure I, I type it correctly. Okay, make sure you save. Last thing I will want to do now is to restart my machine to have this uh, environment variable to be in effect or at least to log in or log out. Uh, as I said in the beginning, I was using the plist edit pro. You don't really need to use it. I just found it easier for me to uh, when I was doing this exercise. Once you start painting again in Modbox, the files, the TIFF files, are not come are going to come out without any compression on them. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this session. I'm looking forward to talk to you more.